Hello everyone. Today I'm at my shop, my boutique La Unique. Um today is May the 5th, 2015. It is after 9 a.m. in the morning, Friday. But uh, I want to show you some things that that's in my shop. I made a line of sheath dresses. I love sheath dresses. I wear them a lot in the one piece dress. And I know some of them still got the little paper tags on them to let me know what the front, because I have not put the uh, tags inside the dresses yet. But this is a printed, uh, like a tribal printed uh, chief dress. It has a, either it could be worn around the waist as a sash or around the uh, neck or, or a headband, whatever that you want. So this is another one, another one. And here's the summer ones. And um, they all are large dresses, all are large. And all of them have scarves and belts also goes with the, except this orange one, I'm still trying to find an orange belt. It has crochet trim at the bottom. So I'm trying to find a cute belt to go with this one if I decide I want one. But these are all the dresses that, and I got some of these other sheath dresses. I like that print on that one. That one kind of comes up then drops down you see at the bottom and it needs to be iron I know but I love that print on it right and here's another one a retro print this is my you like of the 60s or the 50s I love that print and then I have this one that I kind of blinged out the collar I'm going to put a little necktie draped on this one and I know it's coming out like a rainbow color but it's actually it's reflecting like rainbow but it's silver but I'm going to change this to put a black pen leather belt with it I think and the bottom also has uh, rhinestones. And the back has a zipper all the way down. I like that. This dress. And this is the polka dot one that I had. I know these iron rings are all wrinkled. So one day I'm going to come in here and iron all my dresses. And it's going to be this. I like the thought of this black polka dot with the red polka dot. It's little bitty polka dots in it. So you can't really see it because it's so wrinkled. So, I know you see the pins in it because some of the stuff still need to be tweaked. And this is another dress. Uh, these are like more of my, I don't have a line of these. This is more of a business dress. And it's made with the, uh, the suiting material. And it cuts up in the front and drapes down in the back. This is a wrap dress. I think I showed this before. I have two wrap dresses. I have one on the mannequin. This is another dress that's currently being worked on. And this is another dress, like a tie-dye type of dress. So I like that freeform. These are a couple of freeform dresses that I'm working on. And this shirt dress I made a while ago. I love that's one of my favorite actually. So um, let me bag back and show you all the dresses. Uh, but these are my dresses that I designed. I have more at home. These are the jackets, all the jackets. So, uh, all the jackets that I have designed. So, I'm going to start with this one. That's one of my favorite ones. And all of them are going to have belts to them. I brought all these belts. This, all my little pale jackets. And these are the ones that's alike. These got little puffy sleeves. I like these sleeves. I know they need to be ironed. Again, you know, they've been here. This is another one, I, and I have three of these. I like that print. So I got three of these. Here's another cute one with ruffles going around it. And then I have three more that's alike, or well, four more that's alike. I like this one. I just totally freestyled that collar. But I have three of these. Look at that belt. That belt is funky, right? And see the back has a heart lace on it, lace trim at the bottom. This is the exact same pattern, but variations of the fabric, mixture of the fabric with African print fabric at the bottom. Um, you have seen this one before. Actually, a skirt goes with this. Has roses on the hand rolled roses on the lapel. You saw this one before with the leather trim. These, all four of these are exactly alike. This is an old jacket that I made a while ago that's still online. I'm going to take this down to keep it for myself. Here's another one of my favorites. Oh, same, these are from the same pattern, these two. And this one also. I like this one. 
these are just um, jackets that I made so I have quite a few jackets on there I have some hanging up as you see I know I haven't taken any of my winter stuff down yet because I'm not ready to this is going to be like a four season type of clothing line anyway here's all my skirts those are my belts I brought a whole lot of belts uh, so so these are all my skirts all my skirts are going to be exactly like this let me stand back see the asymmetrical love that tails and asymmetrical so all my skirts majority are all the same all of them uh, i have some freestyle type of skirts back here also yeah, this one's a little different got more tails on this white one got more tails on it but basically they're all the same so i got a few of them back here that's a little different a little different um uh, that one's not these but these here's another one that's different I like this one and here's another one these are my free stuff free form skirts and well this one should be here here's another one it's a free form skirt long free form skirt this one is one of my favorites also you can see this stuff I love this one I had a made a skirt like this before look at that one you see I dropped down just totally freestyle I'm going to make more freestyle skirts. Let me just see. More of those freestyle skirts. I enjoy those. I sold some of those. A few of those, I think. To a customer. Now, a few years ago. This is another one. This I love this one. This is just so unique. Has little beads and stuff on it. Oops. The back of it. Everything is from La Unique. I hope you can see all my stuff really good. I hope you can. And that's a freeform freestyle skirt with the belt and the head of display stuff. Um, I'll swing over here. You have you already see my children's stuff. All my children's stuff. Blankets, crochet, teddy bears, bunnies, purses. You already seen all that stuff before. Here's some blouses. I love my blouses. They just so luau like. And they have belts and stuff that goes with them. I've got three of them. That's the same pattern. Don't have their belts. Also with them. This one is a plus size one. Love it. This one. Just pretty. Uh, I got a few pants back here, but I'm not. I don't make pants. But I'm gonna start making leggings. I am really am. I'm gonna start designing leggings. I'm not gonna make. I have some jeans online at home, so I'm actually going to start making some leggings like these. You see these? A whole line of them. Because to me, it's easier to make leggings than to make pants. Because pants, they have to fit, you know? And uh, I love the thought of making pants, but, um, sorry. But if they don't fit, you know, properly... Everybody's shaped differently. So, but stretch pants can always fit people. So, but here's my purses, my crochet purses. Like I said, I still got winter stuff up. Those are all my infinity scarves. All these are all of my infinity scarves. My jewelry, all my jewelry, more scarves, display jacket, display stuff, all that, earrings, whatever, bracelets. And purses, this is and shoes, shoes that I buy new, used. They just display. You know, when I do a fashion show, I have some shoes on hand for the models and stuff. Uh, my beautiful, I love doing these shrugs. Oh, how I love these shrugs! I have five more at home that I'm going to bring online, and of course my shawls i have them displayed with purses and stuff so you know so you can see how to wear them with a purse so i have like <coughs> excuse me everything that i will need in the shop <coughs> excuse me but everything i love this shop every time i go and come in here i'm always so this is my happy place oh you see my corset belts aren't they cute my corset belts I took them offline, brought them back online. Took them offline, brought them back online. But now, you know, I like them. I made them a few years ago. 
Like I said, I still got some on my infinity scarf, my neck warmers. Still on paying up for a season shop. You know, I'm not going to take any of this stuff down. Here's another one. Cute, right? My scarves. Um, I made these scarves. Brought these scarves. So I got scarves I brought, scarves I made, some accessories I made, some accessories that I brought. Except my jewelry. My jewelry, unless I find some really unique pieces, that's when I add it to them. I do have some that I made, but I love this shop. Isn't this shop nice, guys? It's, it's bigger than that other one, as you can see. Remember my tiny, tiny one? This is all my slouch hats and stuff. My braided. These are headbands, just like this. They look just like that. That purse is so funky i found this purse at a thrift store and i thought it just goes with this corner love this corner right and my hats love my hats i love everything that i have created it took me a while to really appreciate everything that i have created and to see when i once i finish my full line of clothing and i'm almost done actually with the full line of clothing I have some more items at home, probably maybe 15 to 20 more items that I need to bring to the shop to complete. But um, I actually love everything I have created. It's been uh, up and down. It's been a journey trying to create this line of clothing, trying to uh, make my stuff uh, pieces that always will be staple pieces that will always be in your wardrobe that's been the big challenge for me you know uh so i see one of my pictures dangling down off the wall i don't know why it is dangling Now you see the picture totally totally dangling off the wall i don't know and i love her and i'm gonna fix her while i'm talking to you guys and i think just because she's and my hangers are falling everybody's falling Everybody's falling. I am a mess. Sorry, guys. I am a mess. Seriously. I just knocked so much stuff over. Really. I, I don't even want to show you what I just knocked over. I knocked, like, hangers over and everything. Actually, I like it much better like that because I had uh, something else that fell over. And I'm going to string her up while I'm talking to you. Now... Sorry. Sorry about that. <laughs> I am a mess. I am a mess. I could have left that alone, right? And just said, you know, I'll fix it when I'm off camera. But I didn't. So that's what I go through. I go through my... I, should I show you the mess that I just did? Okay, I'm going to show you the mess I just did, okay? I just, I'm going to show you the mess. I'm going to show you the mess that I just... See? See, that's what I just knocked over. You see that? I just knocked all that stuff over. Just because... Just because I just wanted to fix that picture. But it's fixed now. See? And it wasn't meant to be off center like that, but it's cool looking. But anyway, back around. Back to talking about all my stuff that I have created in La Unique Design. So I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye bye.